morning campers. That's the just got out of bed look. And that's where we stayed last night. There's my van. And there's the view. Morecambe. Heesham. And the whole of Lancaster. Marvellous. I've come to take Benji for his morning uh, blue run. Come on, Benji. There he is. So we're going to have a tour inside the van today. Come on, Benji. I've just took Benji for his morning blue walk. So he's happy. There's Benji, looking out the window. I've not worn this jacket for a long while and uh, in the pocket I found some old money. £45. Now you can't spend this anymore so I'm hoping I can go to the bank today and change it. So I'm going to put some more old jackets on and see what's in them. You never know. Probably had a couple of beers the night before I took the jacket off and there's the money. I'll have to keep looking. Let's have a tour of the van. I said we'll have a look, good look round, I'll show you what's going on. And a uh, bit noisy here when traffic, some traffic's 100 mile an hour, it's supposed to be 60. But that, I don't know why, they just want to knock themselves out, trying to die before they get to work for some reason. I don't do that, if they get behind me, they're, they're probably going at 40 on this road. And if I go on a motorway at 55, that's, that's it, I don't want to go any faster. I find a wagon, stick behind him, and just follow him all the way up the motorway. If he turns off, I'll find another one to stick behind, about 50 metres away. Morning campers. I said I'd give you a tour of our little van, and uh, let's have a look round. Come Ticky Swift. The front cab. This seat swivels, that one obviously just stays there because it's got the shower there, but this one swivels round and there's your over cab bed, I don't know if you can see that yet, but there's the over cab bed, it's actually quite big in there, bigger than my bed at home, and to get up there you have this ladder. That hooks on there. Trying to do it one handed. There we go. So there's the over cab bed. You have a little light up there. And then you have these shutters for night time. Each side. You can get about three people up there. That's the over cab bed. That's a TV unit. Or oh, the little 12 volt telly that came with the van. You can either go on there or stand freely. Or oh, this pulls out. 240 volt inverter. Plenty of cupboard space. All my camera paraphernalia, cleaning, spare, empty, all the food. This one is a microwave. Utilise, you might as well use the space. All our dishes. Usually all over the place when we're driving. Cups, coffee, coffee mate. Bathroom. So I've got a light. Shower. 
clip to hold the door. That's a shower. The sink, the toilet. The toilet, when you're using it, you slide that lever and that takes the lid off your Thetford cassette that's underneath it. When you're finished, you want to take your cassette out, or well, when you're finished anyway, flush your toilet on the top, which is it's electric, and then close it again and clean as a whistle. Toilet cleaning fluid, Aqua Chem Green. Same shades in there as well. Full blind. Or well, if you want the window open, you don't want flies in. Fly screen. All the windows do all that. Blue roll. Quilts Comfort 3 ply. And full size mirror, or near enough. Sink and fridge. There's the fridge. Now that runs off mains, gas, and battery. So you can flick it wherever you want. And there's your temperature control. Freeze it. And there's the kettle. The folding handle. Whistling kettle for the gas hob. Oven, full size oven, grill, oven, and the electrics. I don't know if you can see them. Push that button, it turns everything off. When you drive and you set off, it goes off anyway automatically. The step comes in as well automatically. And I don't know if I can show you on this. Maybe not. But anyway, that's how you turn it on. And all your lights controlled from these buttons. Indoor lights, outdoor lights. But I'll go into the, uh, the electrics and the heating and hot water. A bit more detail because uh, it can be a bit of a faff to get to work all this. I suppose it's easier than a moderner one because I have no idea about computers but uh, Anyway, I'll talk to you about that, that anyway. That's where we keep the TV. Just out of the way. Two clips, two hooks and a, a, a clip across. This on the floor is a carpet protector. And it's from Screwfix, $13.99 a roll. If you do put it down, take your carpets out. Don't do it in the van, it's impossible. I've tried it and it just doesn't work. You've got to take the carpets out of the van, then put the stuff on, cut it to size and it's fine. It's, it's sticky on the other side, so it's it's quite a faff, but once you've done it, it does protect your carpet. So, we've done it over the whole van. Mainly because we've got grandchildren, spilled pot, breakfast cereals and... So there you go, that's the inside of my van. Oh, skylights there. This one is just a turn handle. That's good access to the solar panel, just for cleaning it. It's always a ladder, I suppose. We've got another bed there. Fitting a bit this morning. 